Hey, what's going on guys? Mr. John Lee here with another awesome video. So I wanted to make this video for two reasons. One, uh, to elaborate a little bit on the uh, one of the last sh YouTube short videos that I made on uh, women being on their period and men and expectations of, uh, you know, relationship issues around that subject. And then two, uh, because I am not able to monetize uh, YouTube shorts because I'm not part of the YouTube partnership program. And I was told because that video, I uploaded it as a regular video, but because it was less than 60 seconds and it was vertical instead of horizontal in landscape mode, it was automatically turned into a YouTube short video. So hence this video here. Real briefly, I'm not gonna make this very long because it's really simple, uh, especially as a man. Um, and I got some comments on that video uh, pretty much almost immediately and I wanted to clarify uh, what I really meant. It's really not about the sexuality. Uh, it's really not about women not, you know, doing, uh, being intimate. It's kind of about not being intimate with their partners, but it's, it's really more about just a complete change in attitude around women having, uh, you know, that time of the month and letting it actually impact yeah us men understand that you have that you don't feel good we understand you know we we try to sympathize but our empathy levels are pretty fucking low because we just don't you know that's not our biology and it's it's not something that we can actually you know it's like childbirth or being pregnant like we can't ever fucking know what that actually feels like and no other man will ever know so i think we you know should be able to get over that but my issue is is that this topic is about um the fact that just because you're feeling bad you know you may be miserable and just because you love somebody doesn't mean that you should treat each other fucking like shit like if you have an awesome relationship like you know regularly all the time you guys you mesh well and you compliment each other and it's a beautiful thing and then all of a sudden <laughs> A week out of the fucking month or four days out of the month or whatever, all of a sudden you turn into like a completely different person where, you know, and, and we've all done this, you know, I'm, I'm just as guilty as anybody when I don't feel good, you know, I fucking attack motherfuckers and I'm overly extra sensitive. Um, but I don't think to the degree that most generally most women are that time of the month. And so yes it's a thing where it's like okay no sex no nothing all of a sudden you're intimate all and affectionate and valid all month long and then that comes along and men honestly legitimately feel like uh you know they, they just don't matter but just because you don't feel good doesn't mean that you should be rude or snotty or overly sensitive and let that you know you're issues may be valid but that doesn't mean that it's valid to let that lash out onto your partner you know just because you don't feel good doesn't mean that your partner doesn't still have that daily yearning for your affection and that intimacy and that connection and that friendship and that commitment and you know intimacy doesn't necessarily have to be through some of these crazy fucking sex capades it could just be you know holding your hand it could just be actually listening to men and how they feel and not having to be all about you and how shitty you feel in that time frame you know this is supposed to be for some reason when that time of the month comes along it's as if women most generally this is a general statement i feel like a lot of women treat men like we just you know, need to listen to how miserable they are, which I, I agree to a certain extent, you know, I should listen for about six minutes. That, that should all be all that I'm expected to have to listen to anybody. But then I should get a chance to say how I feel. And I shouldn't, and nobody should be getting offended. Nobody should be being offensive to the other person while trying to either be heard or uh, speaking to the other person about how they feel. So that's just my two cents, and, uh, you know, like and subscribe on this video, but uh, no offense to the ladies out there, or my lady, it's just a misunderstanding, I promise you, I'm on to the next one.
One of the most hurtful parts of this entire scenario is that for men, we don't have that biology. We don't have a time ever in our lives, in our years, in our months, in our days, in our weeks, where we ever don't feel like, you know, our emotions or intimacy or affection or, you know, regularly, we don't regularly feel like shit to where we're ever in a situation where we're unattracted to our special lady.